Hey, honey, don't forget you need to send those pictures from Julie's recital to your mother. I, I, I wrote it down. What are you talking about? I don't see anything. What? I wrote it last week. <sighs> you know, actually, uh, your new Samsung ES8000 has some great features that let you stay in contact with your family. You can easily share videos and pictures. Have you tried Family Story? No, how does that work? Let me show you. Uh, you start by creating groups which let you decide who can see what content. Mm -hmm. uh, for instance, you could have one group for your immediate family and another group for everyone in your extended family. Oh. Mm. I like that. So once you've created a group, you can add memos and events. And then members of your group can access those memos from the TV or from a mobile device. Oh, that's great. John, now I can tell you to pick up the dry cleaning wherever you are. Yeah, great. What's that? Oh, I said yes. That's, that's great. You can also create albums to share photos and videos. Wow, this is like a social network just for families. Right. Plus, you can even invite family members living from far away to share those pictures and chat in real time using the, uh, the Watch Together feature. Hey, what was that? That was a notification letting you know that you've been invited to another Family Story group. Oh, amazing. Family Story really is a great tool for families. Hi, I'm Michael with Geek Dad, and I like Family Story on the Samsung ES8000 because it lets me interact with my family members, share photos and videos in a way that's a little more social than typically what you think of when you think of social networking. Have you tried the Family Story on the Samsung Smart TV?